in this part of the video we are doing some activity so let us start our first activity the title of our first activity is let's talk about the story so we are talking about the story we are talking about the events the characters of the story so in the first part sorry i am taking the pen in the first part something is wrong said helen's mother what was wrong with helen as you remember in the story after the illness uh, helen keller was not able to see anything nor hear anything she was a child with special needs she could not see anything or hear anything so it is the wrong thing that happened with uh, helen and it is the wrong thing that helen's mother is talking about in the next portion of the uh, activity the question is who agreed to help helen when everyone else thinks that we cannot make helen learn there was a person miss sullivan 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 was a great teacher and you remember that how well uh, she helped her in all the parts in all the activities and make her learn so uh, it was miss sullivan who helped helen to learn and the third part is what was the most important thing that handel finally understood in the last of the chapter it is given that helen understood that words are the most important thing because words would tell the other people around you that what you wanted to do what you wanted to know what do you feel about so words are the final things that are uh, that have superior importance in one's life and if you if you can master words it is more than enough and it was the thing that helen needed most okay so in the second story we have some difficult words right over here and uh, some explanation of the words we have to match the correct word with the correct explanation so i am reading the explanation first and then i am matching words one by one so these words are already used in the story uh, that we have already read okay uh, severe in discipline not relaxed next sickness and poor health i am i am reading the explanations happening quickly to approve intelligent or brilliant very much or greatly or main and great value okay so the word the first word used was dearly dearly was used on the first page her parents loved her dearly so her parents her uh, love her a lot very much so uh, i am just matching the word dearly with very much okay the next thing is illness illness is sickness or poor health good next is bright bright uh, the words used bright uh, was she was a bright little girl what is the meaning of bright yes you guess it correct bright means intelligent or brilliant so bright means intelligent or brilliant agreed where the uh, word agreed was used in the chapter the agreed was used when uh, the teacher agreed to help her to help her mother and help helen keller so agreed refers to approving something to approve okay what is the meaning of important important is main what is main what is, what is of great value it is important next strict what is the meaning of strict guess it guess it from the st story uh, helen liked miss sullivan uh, sorry sullivan she was strict but kind so what is the meaning of a strict okay you are correct a strict means uh, who is not relaxed severe in discipline so i am matching the strict word with severe in discipline okay the last word is suddenly suddenly refers to the word used suddenly suddenly helen understood that w a t e r means something wet running over her hand okay so suddenly which is happening all of a sudden which is happening very quickly so i am matching the word suddenly with uh, happening quickly okay 
so this is a th uh, next uh, and then in the next part of the story we are making some sentences with these difficult words that diff not difficult these are not difficult words of course uh, these are some new words which are new to class 4 students so the words are dearly illness bright agreed important strict and suddenly so as once you have understood the meaning of these words let us make some sentences okay please note that these are exemplary sentences and you have to make your own sentences and you can send us your sentences via mail to kendriya vidyalaya murugabadi and uh, you can also send these to ncert and they will reply you that whether you are doing correct or not okay so i have uh, written some sentences using each word some exemplary sentences so i have taken uh, one example okay uh dearly the first word is dearly you can see that the exemplary sentence is english is very important subject so the important is we have important i have written important here and i have made a sentence important so i have used s like this next is my mom is very strict but she loves me a lot strict the next word is strict can you guess the meaning of strict yes it is not relaxed it is severe in discipline who is very strict is following everything to the rule okay next my teacher agreed to help me in learning a sport agreed agreed refers to approve the teacher is approving you to learn sports the next word is uh, i was in the market and suddenly it began to rain the next word is suddenly so it is happening quickly it is not predetermined so i was in the market and suddenly it began to rain okay so suddenly word is used here in this context the next word we are using in the sentence okay just listen the sentence and observe the word i am a very bright student bright bright student means you are brilliant student you are very intelligent student and the next word is uh uh okay guess the new word in the sentence junk food is responsible for illness among children junk food is responsible for illness illness refers to poor in health very good who is poor in health is called ill so junk food is responsible for illness among children and that is why it is always advised to stay away from the junk food and always prefer healthy homemade food and the last word is dearly that i have written on the top and th this is my favorite sentence i love my country dearly so it's almost here so Uh, this activity completes here